a slobbernaka. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. NC State's going to kick off. Meet me at La Vix. Winds up and kicks. No returns going to be offered here. Miami will start first and 10 on their 25. Beautiful day in South Beach. The sun is shining. I haven't seen a cloud yet. Beautiful day for football. Should be an exciting game. Miami ranked fourth overall. Defending national champions. Defending NWO champions. Wearing all black today. And I cans off to Cheney, who's going to gain three yards on first down. I, I expect we'll see a steady diet of that young man. Cheney is the defending Heisman Trophy winner, so he's going to get a steady diet. Yeah, Wolfpack has their work cut out for him today. Indeed, that is true, Pimp. Single back, we got a wide receiver bunch to the right side. Mike's gonna hurry up, throw. Looks like six yard reception. That's Keyshawn Smith. Brings up a short third down. Yeah, completed the quick pass there. Got tackled rather instantly. No yak on that play. Man motions in. We're passing, and that ball's going to be picked off by the wood. The wood with a nice interception. Wow, yeah, I think that's Steve. Patrick. I think he lays the wood. I think so. Yep, that was number 11. So just like that, NC State's going to take over. Morris is under center. He looked uh, pretty fresh in his limited time last week. And he's going to evade the defenders and uh, pick up seven yards on his feet. It's a great first down game. NC State loves to see that second and short. Yeah, and we'll see if it's a steady diet of Morris today or or if we get big fresh nuts in uh, for a package or two. Handoff is to Allen. He's going to have a first down, pick up a four yards. That's a good start to the drive for NC State. Definitely going to look to stay ahead of the chains. Try to keep the ball moving down the field. Slow and steady. Yeah. It's, it's not rocket science when you lay it out like that, but, you know, <laughs> <laughs> executing the plan can be can be tricky. Yeah, especially when you got a bunch of dogs on the other side of the ball waiting to rip your head off. Mm-hmm. That's the way it is in, in this league. Wide right, single back. Give this to Allen. Gain of two. Looked like he had a little room, but that hole closed damn near instantly. And that's one thing we'll probably notice. Uh, Miami does certainly have a lot of speed, not just on defense, but uh, you'll certainly see those defenders flying around, getting to the ball quickly. Yeah, the black shirts fly around real good. Is to Allen again. He stopped short, loss of a yard. That's a great move by the lineman. Swim right through his blocker and get 
to the ball carry. Or a loss of yards. Hey guys, quick report from the sideline down here. This stadium may only seat 50,000, but it feels like there's 500,000 fans in here right now. It is so loud down here. I know that NC State coach is struggling to get his plays into the quarterback, so keep an eye on that. Hey, thanks for the report, JT. And, you know, those Hurricane fans, they like to support their own, so. takes the handoff he's going to roll to his right looking downfield and he's going to be gobbled up good pursuit by the defense on that play lost five that's a great blow to the ball by the defense that made that tackle it's kind of familiar can't place it there hmm. yeah we'll have to uh check the staff sheet after the game see if uh see if we can locate that young man's name should be interesting fun Dirk Spectra, I believe. <laughs> Fourth and 15, offense is staying on the field here. Morris operating from the gun. Throwing pass, line of game, and that one just sails over the heads of everyone. Incomplete, gonna be a turnover on downs. Tough play to make right there. Mm hmm. Yeah, it looked like he was throwing it for a spot and uh, the receiver wasn't able to break off and get through the defender to get to it and make a play on the ball. Yeah, or it was just crazily overthrown, 50-50. Regardless, he was covered real well. Uh... Mm -hmm. And like under pressure, he's able to get it to Cheney, I believe. He's dodging and dipping and making them miss. It's going to be a 19-yard game. Into Wolfpack territory. And plays respect for defending Heisman for winning the make. Good space. And Blake making some adjustments. Drops back. It's going to be a screen pass to Cheney. Great stop and go, and he is off to the races. Beautiful execution on that play. Oh, good God. Please pick up That should certainly fire up the crowd, right? Tragic. Kick is up and good. Miami strikes first. 7-0. Like they kind of erased the early mistake. Getting back, getting stopped on defense and getting on the board. Kick is away. The same is not going to offer at it. And look back to take over on the 25. Just the crowd noise JT was telling us about. They are going berserk. Well, I mean, if it was loud before, it might be even louder now. <laughs> Too much to Alan bottled up there. We need a game one. Inside run. Looks like the defense is filling the flow. Trying to capitalize on the momentum. Single back is Al again. It's the give up the middle, is able to make something of it. Seven yards. On second down, brings up third and three. That makes it third and three. It's a nice positive game. 
Mississippi State needed that. And it just can they keep it going and get the first down? Third and three. Yeah, manageable third down. Certainly would like to move the ball and answer this very potent Miami program. Now tries to go outside. He's going to gain a new guard. It's not going to be enough. Working two. Again. Long punts. And, and that was going to be muffed and fumbled around before a return is made. And it looks like he's in space. Great shot by a Miami to, to make something from nothing there. Went from a, a muff to a return in an instant. Sheesh. Yeah, it was a great booming punt. May have outkicked the coverage there. From Matt Levix. Cheney takes the hand off. He's going to gain seven on first down. Yeah, he's a, a very dangerous combination of speed and strength and elusiveness. Yeah, he's got it all. Pretty strong eye to give us the Cheney off the right side. He's going to have a first down. Okay, yeah, they gave it to him. Yeah, it looked like he nearly gave it up. Changes. This is going to be play action. It's Pinchino, the tight end, for 12 yards. What a great catch on the sideline. Next gun footing. Yeah, excellent timing on that play. Nice dropping back. Has some time to throw. And this one's going to be intercepted by Mike Jones. Who? Mike Jones! Mike Jones! And that's how the first quarter will end. NC State will take over on the 41 yard line. NC State defense making another big play. Should I not try to not let this game get out of hand? Yeah, the defense is certainly showing up. Just a, a thing to keep eye on down here was the uh, NC State defensive coordinator was getting all over the sideline judge following that catch that went for a completion. Oh, very good. Morris is going to roll out, gets the ball off. That throw sailed on him a little bit. Sean Taylor nearly swooped in and it's was there to uh, pick it up. He did that acrobat So in second and ten, Morris is going to take play action, throw across the middle. This is Brooks making the reception. He's 28 yards in the first down. First down. Made a great catch. Went up, climbed the ladder, and brought it down. Got 
And just what the offense needed. NC State working quickly. This will be a counter play to the right side. Allen with the ball carrier. Gets up 15. Still the edge on that. Fantastic blocks. They'll need some more of that though. Finish the job on this drive. Trips right, Allen in the backfield. Morris, he's going to get the handoff. So drop down for the loss of one. Yeah, tough play right there. Question is, the state was expecting a little better results. But go to show you that Miami defense is ferocious. You have to choose your spots. Same formation. Norris gives down again, trying to run inside. He said he may be a yard. It's just no, no, no space. No gap to squirt through on the line. All covered pretty well. Dropping back as Rooks on the out route. He's going to get up for a first down. Uh, gain of 13 yards inside the five. First and goal. First and goal. Nice completion on the out route. Just with the doctor ordered. First and goal on four. Yeah, NC State doing a nice job of kind of taking what they're given which isn't a whole lot by the stingy defense. Another run for no game by Allen. Morse is going to take it himself, running up to the end of three yards, being stopped just short of the goal line. So Third down. Thought he almost got in there. Yeah, not that's that's a Miami spot if, if there ever was one. <laughs> you got that exactly right. You know, but again, that's that's how stingy that defense has been. Third and goal, Hannah, no penis. And he's going to be brought down for a loss of two. options. Offense will stay on the field. Tough play right there, tough play. Yeah, it looked like Morris was trying to run a speed option to the left side and took it right up the middle. Um, and it looked like they had the pitch pretty, pretty well covered, maybe. I don't know. Leaving a very long field for the Hurricanes. And Van Dyke is going to be come out throwing right away. He's going to gain four yards and first down, just a quick slant route. 
Would offer some breathing room. Right. Exactly. Looks like that's all he wanted to do right there on that play. Get his feet out the end zone. In case there's a mishap. Look to play another down. Both defenses today are performing very well. And that gets Cheney an angle roll. That's going to be good for nine yards. First down, we're at the 15. Trying to slow it down a little bit. Make this the last drive of the night. Something interesting to pay attention to here as the clock does continue to wind. Screen to Cheney left side. He's uh, fast the yard to gain. It's going to be 15 more. I noticed they had a chance to make a cut and go out of bounds. He instead decided to turn inside. Go back in bounds. Take the first down. Clock run. After the change is set. Yeah, this is. There's certainly some strategery uh, involved here with Mises' decisions. Absolutely. Inside two minutes now. Motion, cross formation. He just chaining up the middle. He's going out the first down. That's about 12 yards. Cuts in the hole to avoid the NC State defenders jumping at his heels. Passing on first down. It's going to be complete to Keyshawn Smith. 15 more yards. Chunky yard. Keep moving the ball down the field. While the clock is running. This looks like a wild hurricane. Cheney's going to keep it himself. Before being brought down. But not after a gain of five. Wild hurricane. Fascinating formation. Yeah, I mean, depending on who you talk to, someone might just say it blows. <laughs> and like back in the game now, five wide, using the shotgun. Dropping back and a roll out to his right. Gets past Big Wood. And he'll be pushed out of bounds after four yards, third and two. Time he opts to save time by going out of bounds. More of the cat and mouse game. 30, being played. Yeah, we're at the 36 yard line. Um, Jack, 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 Jack. 98 weasel! 98 weasel! Pretty sure that's pretty close to the field goal range for his kicker. Mm hmm. Miami calls a timeout. They didn't like the look of the defense. Big third and two. And by dropping back. Looking has his man, that's going to be a first down. A little grappy, being six yards, a little 29. Not to stop momentarily at 46. Just when you think you have everything covered, they break out the little short pass and run. Right in the middle of the field, which is so hard to defend. 
We have super athletes. Like Miami does. Yeah, that's not really fair, is it? Timeout this time from NC State. 50 40 50 seconds shot. remaining. Tough deal taking on them hurricanes for anybody. Yeah, if that roster goes up anymore, I think they're going to have to take over like Eastern Michigan or something. <laughs> that would be something. Sanctions. Tragic. Jimmy makes the first man miss. And bullies the other guy to get 11 yards on the play. Cuts again by Chino. That he's gaining momentum here. As Miami seems to be able to just you know, eat up first downs at will in this, in this two minute drill. And yeah, doing it very well. Chain left side stopped at the minus one. That is a loss of one yard. That brings up second and goal. Great pursuit by the defense on that play. To catch them in yeah, the they all game. showed up there. All right. Gonna need more of that to try and force a field goal attempt or a turnover. Yeah, 14 seconds now. That's really. What's what you're hoping for is just keep them out of the end zone. Three plays, best case scenario, three plays. Okay, one time out. Uh, yeah. And the Gaz is mad. And I'm not sure if that was fumbled or... What just happened there? I think Chino was on the sideline there and, and it looked, I don't know if he got hit the ball, was knocked out and it took him a minute to recover and just... It almost looked like uh, he was going to get an extra chance to get up and get into walk into the end zone there. Not that. You know, just going to be forced to take time off. Two seconds remaining and line up for the field goal. And he takes the points. Yeah. So 10 nothing at halftime. It has been exciting. Maybe more defense than uh, we might have anticipated, but... I guess that's not uh, to be unexpected from these two clubs. Yeah, the offenses are definitely behind in this matchup on both sides. Yeah. We certainly see an advantage uh Miami when it comes to some of these offensive numbers here. Yeah, they got a clear advantage. But it looks like turnovers is keeping the game close. Yeah, I mean, that's really it. The Wolfpack defense has kept them in this ball game. Two big interceptions came up clutch. Mm hmm. Gonna need the NC State's gonna need the offense to try to pull us on weight in the second half. Stay close. Yeah. It's gonna take, um, you know, continued effort here. From the defense and the offense is going to need to to contribute for sure absolutely but i like what we've seen you know um good tough hard nose football game so far would expect nothing less from these nasty pounds right And Miami looked really impressive um, getting down into the red zone in that two-minute drill. You know, but there again, the Wolfpack defense was able to tighten up and hold them to a field goal. So 
Yeah, did a great job of burning off the whole two minutes, two plus minutes on the clock as well. Um, I don't recall who who receives the second half kicked here. Yeah, I do not recall either. It might be Miami. Yeah, I think North, I think NC State kicked off to begin, so Miami should be getting the second half kickoff. So it's yeah. going to be a tall order. NC State needs to step up and get a stop, and then get up, get themselves on the board here. I do think for NC State would be a see a three and out, but we know how that goes. You got the hurricane mm -hmm. on the other side of the ball. It's a tall order. Both coaches talking to their teams, going over the game plan here for the second half. Appreciate everybody hanging out tonight. Indeed. Always love to see the fans come out, watch these wonderful NWO games. Appreciate you. And we're in no hurry here. Coach Vamp is giving an extra motivational speech to the squad. And I'll appreciate that, allegedly. Good motivational speech can turn the game around. Mm-hmm. Should be getting close here. Right. Other action going around the league. I think we have another game scheduled for Monday evening. Is that correct? I believe so. It'll be Penn State, Wisconsin, Coach Dark Spectre against Coach Russo. The Miami Hurricanes is lined up yes. for the kickoff. Be interesting test. Number 15, back to return. It's a savvy badger, so Coach Russo. Look forward to it. All right, Wolfpack take over on the 25. Start the third quarter here. So it is Wolfpack ball. Yeah. Let's see what they can do with that. MJ Morris going to get flushed out. Just barely get the ball away. Save the quarterback from getting destroyed. Cause it looked like two guys were coming through. Scott Free. Looked like the back and the lineman stepped up. Gave him time to roll out the pocket and throw it away. Yeah, Miami Bass Rush is for real. Camera. It's going to be an 11-yard gain and a first down. Number 24, 
brings him down. First time we've called his name today. That makes it first and ten. Always love to see action from the giant cock hammer swinging. Oh, mm -hmm. to Allen, that's going to be four yards, brings up to second and six. I'm not sure who that was, but he had time, he's fast enough to run all the way around the block and get to the ball carrier. Holy could have been, on this defense, could be anybody. <laughs> that's ridiculous. That's what a world-class athlete on the football field looks like. Check three, check three, check three. Set, three, 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 three. Three, three, three. 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 this to Sumo this time. He'll be spelling Allen. That was, a, that was a bad one right here. Need lots of practice to get that sumo name out there. I mean, I fumbled around with it a few times the last, last time. <laughs> easy, 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 easy. Shoot, shoot. Easy, 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 easy. Switch, switch, switch. Unless somebody's going to be out for two quarters. <laughs> Didn't notice. More still is incomplete. So bring up fourth and five from 41. Looks like we'll see the punt unit in the one field. Going. I'm going to have JT give us a report from the sidelines in a minute when he finds out something. Yeah, I'm getting reports down here that a player from either team is out for a little bit. Uh, I, I'm i not getting good uh, good answers from either medical staff. They're kind of keeping it tight lipped down here. Booger sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, right. Give us to the motion back. Hello, <laughs> Brinson. He's going to pick up 10 yards. That's Hurricane offense is on it. They just keep running them out. One goes out, another one comes in. Chain is stifled in the backfield, lost two, two yards. yards That's the Wolfback defensive line on that one. Yeah, they got in the backfield. Fast. So we're going to bring him down. Get him in there soon. So you want to see And like back to pass, throwing deep up the seam has his man. Behind the coverage. Yeah, that is Gucci LeFleur Jr., speedy receiver, and he is gone, gone. And that's all it takes. This guy is so dangerous. I mean, that's the making mistakes for him to score. They just take it. Take what they want. Sheesh. Well, you'll play them soon enough. It'll be fun. Uh, thrilling. Thrilling peel. Again, the crowd is rocking now. Going berserk once again. Gotta love what they see. 
so far. There's some plays to be made though for NC State to get back in it. Morris just threw that directly to the outside backer. And as I say that, pick six. Tragic. That's about the worst. Struggled a little bit with accuracy. It's it's showing here in the second half here. Yeah, that was an errant pass. I'm not sure what happened there. Not the kind of play that the Wolfpack needed to get back into the game. It's going to make it kind of difficult. Back it up and try again. Kick sails through the uprights, I think. Looked like it. Yeah, we'll take it at the 25 all the same. Four wide sumo in the backfield with Morris. Takes the handoff. He's going to scramble to his right. Looking downfield, throwing, and that ball is picked off. Nice return, breaking several tackles. Ultimately brought down at the 29 yard line. And that was just a great play by the defender to get his hands on the ball. The entire Hurricane team is throbbing right now. Yeah, uh, they all rocked up and looking bloodthirsty right now. Nine more yards for Cheney. Man of Riches is definitely out on display right now. Sheesh. Another good game. Convert on the Convert to the first down. Three yard run. Three and a half minutes remaining in this third quarter. Lots of motion from Miami. They're keeping it confusing. Give us to Cheney. Easy 10 yards. Down to the six, first and goal. And we saw the NC State defense show up most of the early part of the game, but do they have enough to fight back now? Fatigue might be setting in. Give to Cheney, and he's gonna get in for the score. Yeah, defense might be tired. Kick is up, making it 31 to 0. We will see big fresh nuts. Looks like you are correct. So I think since they coaches seen enough. I'll try to get a spark. Finish up the rest of this game.
And it looks like the competition at quarterback is still wide open. Yeah, it's not really a great thing to be in a quarterback competition when you have to play the Hurricanes. No. No matter who you are, they can make you look bad real easy. Rashnas gets the ball away. The cockhammer, that's a 22 yard gain on first down. Love to see that first completion. Try to build on positive momentum. It's really about stacking success at this point. Yeah, one play at a time. Got to build that momentum bit by bit. So Fresh Nuts making some adjustments before dropping back. Able to get the pass away, but that one's... if it was dropped or if it was tipped but incomplete nonetheless yeah kind of hard to tell on that play go back and try again see what we got and that looked like a drop yeah incomplete out to the same Usually don't see Lassane dropping balls like that. Yeah, he doesn't have the greatest hands. He's he's really a, a threat when he's got the ball in his hands. Yeah, he is a return specialist, so that could be it too. Pressure from the right side. Big nuts sacked for a loss of nine. Yeah, he just had no time on that play. As soon as he got back there and set up, with somebody in his face. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I also just said big nuts and sacked. <laughs> uh, nice. Love to see it. Okay, we should the floor brought down after four yards. Hurricanes will take over on their own 18. Question to just look in the mount one drive. to drive if they can help it mm -hmm. so you see Cheney pick up seven yards there on first down Franklin Jr. on the carry. Another one in the stable of backs. Yeah, Cheney getting a well-deserved breather, I'm sure. He's definitely played well today. Franklin Jr. from the strong eye. I think that's extra girthy on the tackle. Yeah. Got to the ball carrier before I could get loose. Yeah, it's a great short play. game. I'm 
got about 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Give us to Cheney. Picks up five. Nice little run. Makes it third and four. Will they keep it on the ground or be aggressive trying to convert the first down? That'll do it. We enter the fourth quarter. NC State trails Miami by 31. Junior on reception. After a quick strike. I guess we got our answer. Prior guys getting the first down, possessing the ball. Now he gets the first down and the chance to run more clock. Yep. And round. That makes it second and six. Smith with a pickup of four. Kane, motion coming in, hand off is to Franklin. Sniffed out pretty well by the Wolfpack. Yeah, that was a good play by the defense to hold him no gain. Closed up all the holes. Is to Cheney. He's going to pick up four yards, but that's going to bring up fourth and two. Question is, are we in field goal range? At the 40, that's a 57 yarder. You know, that's. It's pretty long. Will he out to punt? Kicker was kicking him from 65 in practice earlier today. Wow. Kick is up, and it is good. He nailed it with ease. Sane's going to take this one out of the front of the end zone. And bring it up to the 21 or 2. Or just the 20. You know, these Miami refs. <laughs> Definitely give them the home spots a lot this game. Huh? Yeah. yeah, it's okay. Freshness throwing beyond the sticks. And that, that's going to be picked off. I think that's Huff again. And that right there is an excellent show of sportsmanship right there. Because I'm pretty sure that could have been a pick six. And he 
chose to dive on the ball and go down. Heavy formation in. It's number 33 on the carry. Brantley. Have we called his name today? Uh, I think he's like the short yardage back. If if they need such a specialist. <laughs> yeah, seems kind of rare. Franklin is going to have just enough for a first down. Gain on the run from Franklin there. Yeah, like Clock continues gonna, to tick. It's going to pound the ball. And Franklin able to knife his way in. Nice gain up the middle. a potent team running their offense instead of chewing the clock like they like to they just happen to get too many yards on the run Which I reckon we will see a lot this season Yep, kick sails out of the end zone. So 313 remaining in the fourth quarter. The Wolfback offense takes over. Fresh nuts pressured as he throws. Able to get it to Sumo Kambaye, who I was tackled for a loss of one. It's a tough one to spit out. Not sure I can make it. Alright, you just gotta go for it. <laughs> Cannonball! <laughs> Freshman slinging it, that's the same. He's going to bring this one down. First, first and ten. The same uh, suffered a big hit there. Able to hang on. Yeah, that was a great pass. Big hit, but he brought it down. Flip. That's a... Rooks on the catch. Fresh nuts is like he can wing it a little bit, huh? Yeah, he's got significantly more arm talent than Morris, but has, you know, almost none of the evasionary skills. Yeah, has the look of a pure pocket guy. Makes 
Looks like he still has to learn how to when and where to use the touch to fit the ball in the pocket. Mm-hmm. Yeah, a little out of the comfort zone. Probably missing Huelos Grandes, who is a nice combination of both of those skill sets. Early season, new roster, growing pains. Fresh nuts rolling out to the right. It's gonna, looks like he was going to keep that, but uh, pulled up and threw it to the same. At the last second, nice play. Yeah, it ended up being a dot in the end. That was pretty nice throw right there. Yeah. Freshnots doesn't run all that well, but uh, throw on the run looks pretty nice there. <laughs> all right. If you can get him in a situation to run. Rooks well covered on that play. Swatted down. Yeah. They were just looking, waiting for that ball to come and swat it down or do worse. Give us the sumo. Right side, he's going to be in for the touchdown. It's a great job by the offensive line to open up a hole and keep it wide open for the back to get through. Kick us up in good, 41 to 7 now. And I guess it's just a small victory. Getting off the schneid is nice. <laughs> yeah. Better to erase that donut on the scoreboard. Still have been a tough day for the Wolfpack. Yeah, they fought hard all day. Defense held in there as long as they could. Got overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. See Frank when the second string back still put in work. Gaining six yards on first down. First string, second string. Three, three formation. Don't see a real like we'll see now. one more of those, and that'll be all. Yeah, looks like that's about it. Thank you for your questions for the coaches. Post game should be interesting. Interested to see what the coaches have to say about the second half adjustments. Time out on the field. Mm -hmm. Looks like the NC State coaches play some head games for next season. Mm hmm. <laughs> Did call that timeout, didn't he? <laughs> nice little turn by the same. They want one more play. See what they can do with it. Right 
Some more coming in motion. Three all by himself up the left side. And he's gonna score a touchdown. Well, I guess we know what Coach 49 had in mind, don't we? Mm hmm. Never too late to put points on the board. A surprise finish there. NC State able to sneak another touchdown. No pants. Hey, great job, coach. It seemed like everything was going well. When when did uh what was the moment where you felt like you were in control of this ball game? Um Honestly, once the game started fucking hooking me up with interceptions and shit, that's pretty much, you know what I'm saying? The game started giving me a little bit of cheese because there was one point where I was trying to move a guy and get him into a different position pre-play. And when I switched to another player, it moved the guy back to where he was originally at where I didn't want him but he ended up making the fucking pick on the play so it's kind of like got hmm. luck of the draw on that <laughs> and then that's what I'm saying there's a couple things that you know can swing your favor and once you start getting a couple picks it's that's how it rolls yeah well as always Cheney looked impressive um you know, he had a 139 yards on the ground, it looks like, but I'm sure he accounted for most of those. Yeah, Cheney had 92 yards rushing. I ended up switching him and a few other running backs in and out in the second half to kind of just, you know, keep Cheney fresh for the long run. There's no point of really pounding him into the ground early in the season. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, I look forward to seeing you the rest of the year. It looks like you've got Notre Dame against the computer next week. Um, well, so mark that on the calendar. Spectate, what do you got for Coach? Great game, Coach Revamp. Appreciate it. I got a question. Yeah. What did you get – what did you do to get your team going at halftime? It seemed like after, after halftime you just took off. I mean, honestly, it's just – that's just the way the game is sometimes, man. You know, I feel like early in the game I was – wasn't really necessarily forcing things, but I wasn't really letting all my reads progress. And 49er made a couple great user interceptions early. Uh, like, if y'all go back and watch it, he made some crazy-ass, mm -hmm. like, mm -hmm. plays user-wise. And I really just kind of told myself at halftime, I got to stop just looking for certain dudes pre-play that I want to hit. And then just, you know, when you kind of stare down a guy. So I just kind of just said, just spread it, look for the open man. And really the defense was just the main thing. They, they were the one making plays. <clears throat> Great game, coach. Appreciate you. Appreciate you, pal. Appreciate you calling the game too, pal. Enjoyed it. No problem at all. All right, let's go. Go celebrate with your team. Let's see if we can get Coach 49 and George in here to join us. Good game, revamp, and uh, good call, guys. Appreciate you. Yeah, um, you know, another big learning week for you. Uh, you know, Morris started a quarterback and you went to fresh nuts late. Um, what positives did you see from each of those guys and what can you take uh, moving forward in the season? Um, I mean, I like what I saw from the freshman late. Um, I did not like what I saw from Morris. Uh, I think it's a matter of 
maybe the home start should have went to the redshirt sophomore last week rather than the freshman. And then freshman probably should have been the, the sacrificial lamb here uh, in Miami in week two. But hindsight's, uh, you know, the grass is always greener, that kind of shit. So mm -hmm. um, QB competition still open. Uh, not the best thing, but we're going to have to figure this out on the fly while we still have some non-conference games. Yeah, it looked like your defense was hanging tough the whole first half. Um, and then maybe they were just overexposed and on the field too much. It was, is that your perception or? I mean, somewhat, yeah. The first half was really held down by the defense. And it was the offense that really kind of fumbled the ball away there at the one yard line where we didn't score. Mm -hmm. uh, you got to credit their defense. Unbelievably tough right there at the red zone. Getting stout right there at the one yard line and stuffing us. We tried just about everything. Um, just couldn't put the ball in the end zone. Otherwise, it's 10 7 at half. And then that's a pretty good uh, position to be in for the second half as we got the ball back at the second half. But right away in the second half, it was uh, too much Morris. Probably should have made the uh, quarterback move there at halftime when Morris wasn't able to do anything with the ball. Um, uh, I mean, he had that one drive, but we couldn't, we couldn't finish it. Uh, probably should have went to the freshman right then but uh second half i mean their their defense just really came alive and the learning part is that you know we've probably seen the last the first probably the my hardest two matchups for throwing straight into the teeth of the defense i always have the most trouble with with cincy and with revamp on that there's one more coach in the league that i'll, I'll remain nameless right now but he knows who he is it's really hard to throw on him too so uh, you know, just trying to learn quickly here in the beginning of the season with no conference games yet. Yeah, sure. And you've got Iowa next week. And uh, I'll let you go with that uh, on, on to whatever spec to has. Thank you for your time, Coach. Tough Thanks. game, 49er. Well, yeah, you, man. Actually, you actually answered the question I was going to ask already. Mm -hmm. So with that being said, hell of an effort. And good luck next week, Coach. All right. Thanks. Appreciate you guys. Good game. Appreciate you. All right. Well, that does it for tonight's NWO action. Um, keep in mind, we do have a game scheduled Monday night, the 17th. That'll be 10 p.m. Central. So Wisconsin at Penn State, I believe. Uh, join us then. Everybody have a good, safe weekend. Uh, we'll try to find you a nice soft landing spot. Take care, everybody.